welcome back to Poppins Prue. This is the new Fawn Design Tote. And as you can see, I haven't taken off like the packaging here because I just got it, but I just kind of moved it down so that I could see how these tote handles kind of felt on my shoulder. So that's why, if you're wondering what that is, that's just the packaging. I haven't decided if I love it yet. Okay, so when I saw this online, I was really intrigued by it. I don't know why, it just, it's a simple, tote but simple is kind of in style right now and so it just I was drawn to it I thought it was really pretty um, especially in this brown color I don't know it just screams fall to me and fall is my favorite time of year and so I'm really excited getting ready for like all of the like warm clothing and cardigans and coziness of fall and I feel like a nice brown bag kind of speaks to that a couple things that I was surprised by was the weight of it. It's three pounds and it's not that big of a bag. And so I'm kind of surprised at how heavy it is, but I think it's just because they use the same exact material on the inside as the outside, just like their regular backpack style bag. And so that really weighs down the bag because it's a heavier material. The zipper that's here on top, I really love that. A lot of tote bags just have like a magnetic closure or it's just an open tote. So I love that this actually has a zipper to keep everything in your bag and nice and secure. It is gold hardware, as you can see. Really, really nice and smooth, no problems there. It comes with a messenger strap and you can attach that to, you can see here the tiny little um, D-rings where you can attach your messenger strap to. I kind of like that they're hidden down here so that they're not on the outside of your bag. So everything on the outside is nice and streamlined. And then you also get this little guy, which I think is to clip onto one of these D-rings and like hold your keys. So you have a place for your keys, which I really do like that. I think that's a nice feature. On the inside, you can see right here, you have a long zipper and behind that, there's a magnetic little closure there. And behind that is a flap where you can fit a laptop. I'm pretty sure they said you can fit up to like a 13 inch laptop in here. And then on the other side, you just have two slip pockets. And then on the sides here on the inside, you have two other little slip pockets that are a little bit smaller. Pretty nice and roomy in there. Um, I thought I wasn't gonna mind having any pockets on the outside, but I wish there was at least like on the back, like one little zipper pocket for your phone. Because um, yeah, I'm, I'm seeing now that if this is zipped up, it's gonna be really like tricky to grab for your phone. So I wish there was some sort of like, just a small pocket, maybe a slip pocket or a zippered pocket on the outside somewhere. But I, I understand what they were doing. They were trying to keep it really simple and classy. So I do get that. Um, another thing that kind of bugs me is, these tote handles. I wish they were just a tiny bit longer. I mean, it fits over your shoulder, but I can see this is gonna fall off super, super easily. If it was just a little bit longer, maybe it's just on my frame, <laughs> but if it was just a little bit longer, I can see these tote straps staying better. Um, but yeah, I can see that these are going to, one is gonna fall off and I'm not a fan of that. I have been using this Ryla pack here, so I'm just gonna, just for the sake of the video, kind of pull stuff out and throw them in here and let's just quickly see how much can fit. Okay, I have a bee dapper that has all my like snacks in it. I'm just gonna stick that down in the center with the handle up, because that's a good way for me to grab it. I also have my, what is this? Uh, what are you? Large set piece that has all my diapering needs in it. Little small set piece here and that has all like my mommy stuff. I'm gonna put that in one of these side pockets. All right, I have like pens, tied to go pen, marker, things like that. I'm not really sure what the where the best place, oh, probably right here, there's a the long zippered pocket in the back, so I'm gonna stick those in there. I have my keys in here. Um, I think it will be awesome to use this little key leash thing for my keys, so I'll clip that onto there. Okay, and then onto the little D-ring on the inside of the bag, so there are my keys, that's nice. Um, I feel like it's a little bit long. It could be a little bit shorter because it's pretty long, but there you go. That's there. I have this little small be organized piece. That's gonna go in one of these slip pockets. You can see there, I put it in one of those slip pockets right there. It fits great. And then I have a little toy here for my kids. I got it from McDonald's. So I'll put that in the other slip pocket there. Pouch for receipts and things. And I'm gonna put that inside, back inside that zippered pocket 
on the back with all like the pens and stuff and then my checkbook will go in there as well I had to pull it out it's in the car headphones in here I think maybe I'll just put those in that little zippered pocket as well I'm kind of running out of pockets on the inside because I usually have some pockets to work with on the outside so it's kind of weird for me to have to put all of it inside okay so I have a coin purse and my wallet and maybe I will okay I'm gonna put the toy somewhere else I'm gonna put that in this side pocket over here and then I'm gonna put my wallet and this coin purse in the other slip pocket back here that'll be a good place to like grab for it easily i think oh i have some lip gloss here i'll put that probably in the zippered pocket as well on the back here of the ryla pack this is where i have like thin items so this is just a bunch of random stuff so i have like a brochure my little notebook i have some pictures i have some wipes there's just lots of a book thin kind of random stuff little boogie board is in there so what i'm going to do is actually put these items back here in the little flap so you t that has a little magnetic flap which i really like i love magnets so a little magnet and then you have this space here for what you could use a, for like a ipad or like a tablet could go here computer okay so let me give you a little bird's eye view really quickly so in here that's where i have my wallet my coin purse that's where the med kit is. I have my snacks, my diapers and wipes. And here is some like different kind of mommy things in the zipper. And then back here are all those thin items. On the side I have a toy attached to this key leash. I have my keys. And then on the other side I have this piece that has like floss and compact other mommy stuff. See if it zips up, yeah, oops zips up great you have these two open spots here so that you can attach this to your messenger strap okay so that was just a super quick look at the new fawn design tote i do love the material on the outside it feels really nice and i think it looks cute and like slouchy but the handles are something that i just can't get over because normally i like to wear my bags backpack style which you guys know and so i was gonna you know kind of take a chance on a bag that didn't have backpack straps but um, if the tote straps don't work for me either, then it's just a no-go. I wish the tote straps were just a little bit longer and I wish the bag wasn't so heavy. It's three pounds by itself and I know that like some of the Lily Jade bags that I've had are, which are real leather, because this is faux leather, and those ones are real leather and they weigh less than this bag. So, And I think it's just because they've used that same faux leather on the inside as well so that it's nice and wipeable and cleanable. But um, for me, I think I would rather have some sort of like nylon material on the inside that's still wipeable, but it's gonna be a little bit of a lighter material so that even when you put all your stuff in there, it's not gonna be too heavy. So I hope you guys enjoyed this review of the Fawn Design Tote. If you have any requests or any questions about this bag, please leave them in the comments below and we will talk to you guys soon.